I'm meteorologist Julie Chin. We are just around the corner from the long holiday weekend. Perhaps you've already uh, started your weekend celebrating. Looking through our Brookside cam, light south breezes, a lot of sunshine and a lot of heat. That's going to be the trend through the long holiday weekend. In fact, here's a peek at that three-day weekend forecast on Saturday, a high of 101, 100 on Sunday. We're going to see highs nearly at 100 for Monday. I'm going 99 degrees. A low chance of a few storms on Monday. Don't cancel your plans. And you need to know, too, the storm chance is less than 20 percent for Saturday and Sunday, but it's not zero. Some isolated storms will be possible. So whatever your plans are, you'll just want to keep an eye to the sky. But mainly we're looking at the heat. In fact, we do have excessive heat warnings still in effect for tolls up towards Washington County, even across the state line into southeastern Kansas. Also, heat advisories uh, in effect for the rest of northeastern Oklahoma. We're still looking at afternoon heat index values that'll be around 105. The air starting to dry out a little bit, so it might not be quite as muggy this weekend, but it is still going to be hot. We started off the day, by the way, at 75 degrees, 71 is normal. The record for this day in history is 106. I think this record is safe. We're shooting for about 102 by this afternoon. Of course, we're tracking our holiday heat wave. There will also be a weak front up to our north into Kansas through this weekend. And that's what could throw a few rain chances our way, especially by Monday, depending upon where that front ends up. And then again, I mentioned those isolated storm chances for today, Saturday, and also Sunday. We have a ridge of high pressure on top of us. That means there's some rain well down to our south, up to our north, kind of going around us. But this isn't a very strong ridge. There's some weaknesses in there, and that's why I think we could see a few showers and thunderstorms bubble up. We actually saw that yesterday in the heat of the afternoon. I think there will be a few today, although I don't think the coverage today will be quite as much as we saw yesterday. But Futurecast tries to paint a few, especially south and east of Tulsa. If a storm pops up, it's going to fall apart once the sun sets. Saturday morning looks dry, and again, watching a front to our north on Saturday. Could be one or two storms southeastern Kansas, northern Oklahoma, but again, the chance right now is less than 20. 20%, so I'm mentioning it, but not officially in the forecast. 103 will be your high today in Jinx. Also 103 in Bartlesville, 100 in Muskogee. It's fireworks night at uh, the Drillers game, 99 at 7 p.m., 94 by 9 p.m. By about 11 p.m., we should be in the upper 80s. And tomorrow morning, dropping into the upper 70s, back to the triple digits. So we head into Saturday, Sunday, 100 degrees. I got to tell you, I don't have a lot of relief on the seven day forecast. Basically, every day, morning lows near 80 degrees, afternoon highs near 100. We will maybe start to see the pattern change by next Thursday with a slightly better chance of some showers and storms.